Who told you to wear satin pants to Pilates, lady? Cause a man ain't got that cone, baby. I wanted that cone. Shorty, I'm from Baltimore. Don't play with me. You better back the f up. Ah! <laughs> Deanna, girl, you knew what you was doing when you made these, baby. May I have a large cup of ice water yes, and, and a grande um, brown sugar shake and espresso? Of course. That's it. Okay, grande ice brown sugar shake and espresso. And the ice water is 622. May I take your hand? Kim. Say Kim. Kim, yeah. You can pull on through. Thank you. Thank you. The lies you tell, bitch. <laughs> The lies you tell, sister. You just gonna lie to that man like that and say your name, Kim. I have Apple Pay. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good one. Yeah, you too. Good morning. Good morning to you. These are not spirit fingers. These are spirit fingers. <laughs> Good morning, y'all. Happy Monday. Today's Monday. Your girl picked the camera up the next day. Ooh. Mm. Oh my gosh. That was love. Anyway, why am I up so early? I got up at five and I told myself last night, actually, I got I was gonna get up at five. I got home last night. If you have not seen the vlog before this, then that's what I'm talking about. So I went out for the weekend. Obviously, I feel like pff, now that it's Monday. You know, after you drank and you party, party hardy, like a rock star. For three days straight, which I ain't complaining about because we had a good damn time. But it's time to get back on regular program. So I feel like, pfft, you know, so I got to snap back, get myself together. So I told myself last night, even though I went to bed at 12, went to bed at 12, all you need is about a good five, six hours of sleep. I can only speak for myself. I don't remember the last time I had eight, four hours of sleep. So, touche. But I told myself last night, I put my alarm for 5 o'clock. I said, I'm going to get up in the morning. I'm determined. I'm going to take a jog. Well, not a jog, but I'm going to do some sprints this morning. We better go to the gym. And then I have a Pilates class. I'm not going to take y'all inside of the Pilates class because I took y'all to Pilates yesterday. And I'm not but a key. You know what I'm saying? Like, y'all get it. I go to Pilates. <laughs> And I go to Pilates four to five times a week. So if I'm picking up the camera a few times in a week, baby, you ain't about to keep seeing Pilates every time, every vlog. You know? But yeah, I'm going to do some sprints just to get my adrenaline rushing. And plus, I need to get back to running because, yeah, I just do. And then I have a car. No, I don't have cardio today. So today is actually booty day with um, the Pilates. Today is called control 1.5 so this class is going to be hard it's going to be a lot of bridges oh, like i ain't got time for this shit but <laughs> we're gonna do it but before I, before i go to the gym which i'm gonna take y'all i'm gonna take y'all to the gym y'all can see me do my sprints and i'm gonna show y'all like me going into pilates but i'm not gonna take y'all in there anyway um this is my starbucks drink which is a grande brown sugar shake and espresso I got this drink idea if I but if I'm not mistaken from Aaliyah, Aaliyah's face. Don't get me wrong if this ain't really her drink. It's from her or somebody shit or TikTok. I don't know. But let's give it a run. You know what I'm saying? You gotta shake this one up because it be the whole bunch of brown sugar at the bottom. 
You know what I'm saying? So you gotta mix that bad boy up, honey. Honey, I don't like no sweet coffee. I like to get straight to the point. Boost me up, baby. Give me that espresso and yeah. Mm hmm. Mm. Uh, anyway, y'all. I'm gonna see y'all in the gym in a second. In five, four, three, two. Cameraman, do the transition. One. Gym scene. <laughs> Yeah, I got too much energy. All right, I'm out. We're at the gym. So, I got my Boost shoes on. Shout out to my dad. He got me these. These are Ultra Boost by Adidas. Adidas. These make me run faster for some reason. I don't know what it is about these shoes, but, baby, they make me feel like I'm doing something, which I be doing something. But they give me that extra boost. Say my class is in one, no, probably less than an hour now. My Pilates class is at 6.30. 6.30 in the morning. Yeah, so I gotta leave here at least by six, six something. It sounds so crazy saying five something, six something, like we not talking about in the morning. <laughs> it's five in the morning and I'm out talking. I just noticed he said he talking phone sex at five in the morning. The fuck? Summer night. <laughs> and now I'm on the highlight. <laughs> it's so crazy because I'm gonna run after this, but it's so crazy because you would think that as much as I like sing and be dancing and all that on, on my vlogs, I still make it to places where I need to be on time. Like, I don't know what it be. It's like I include the singing and dancing in part of my time that I need to get ready. <laughs> So I'm gonna tell y'all my circuit real quick that I do for my sprints and then I'm done chatting with y'all until I'm done. So I warm up good five minutes or so. I don't have enough time to do five minutes today. So probably like three minutes on incline four, speed 2.5. And then for my actual sprints, I keep the incline on four the whole time, but I take my speed up to like I don't know, I'm a little rusty. So probably today it'll be like 7.5. But 30 seconds run, 30 seconds off, 10 times. Period, ah, period, uh. All right, y'all, we are at Pilates, but this is a different location, y'all. So y'all have not seen me at this location. I didn't even see this 30 minute parking sign. I don't think they are gonna do nothing. I'm confused, pound. Two, four, eight, three, pound. Oh, y'all was almost tripping. Two hours later. Class is over, y'all. Y'all, she almost made me want to fight her, how hard that class was. But it was good, though, so. I see y'all when I get home. I gotta get ready for work in almost an hour, which is enough time to go home, take a shower, and get myself together. So, I see y'all a few hours or something, I don't know. <laughs> Probably when we about to make breakfast, cause I'm hungry now. Peace. Hey y'all, so obviously it's been some hours later. I'm on my break, so only got like 15 minutes right now to make me some breakfast, but <laughs> before I do that, first of all, y'all, let me tell y'all real quick. I'm sorry, I gotta vent real quick. <laughs> I feel like I'm always talking shit. Y'all, this morning, the lady at the Pilates, it was, I had never been to this lady's class before, which it wasn't the instructor. Uh, I actually like the instructor. First of all, I forgot today is 80s week. So one of these days I'm gonna dress up kind of 80s, I guess. I already got some um, slouch socks from the hair store to kind of match one of, a pair of my Pilates socks, which is pink. 
So one of these days, um, I'm going to actually, you know, dress up or whatever. But the lady that was next to me today in class, when I tell y'all, <laughs> complain the whole class. I mean, my thing is today was hard. I'm not going to lie. Today was hard for Pilates, right? But baby, just as much as you tired and your arm this and your legs this and just as much as you are lady is just as much as everybody else so can you please shut up and why did i have to be the one next to her when i tell and i could tell the instructor was getting irritated with it because she had something to say about everything then she trying to tell the instructor how to do the exercises that she telling us to do she's talking about you should have got us to do this you should have you should have had us to do this lady just do the damn class and shut the hell up i'm sorry y'all that might be mean but y'all, when I said I could not wait to get out of class this morning because she was talking the whole class. Then she talking about, oh, I'm just sweating so much. I have on these satin pants. Who told you to wear satin pants to Pilates, lady? Anyway, that's my little quick vent, rant, whatever. On to some positive notes. I did not tell y'all, y'all don't even know that your girl just got a, well, not just did. I had it for like probably at least a week or two now. I got a tablet. And this is the newer generation, the ninth generation. I'm not even sure if y'all had seen yesterday on the vlog, um, if y'all seen that I was like listening to music while I was cutting the flowers and stuff. And I was listening to music on the iPad girl. So hold on, let me go get my little pen that I got and then I'm gonna show y'all. Y'all probably have seen this iPad already. It's the ninth generation. I got the pro. <laughs> so let me just get my little stylus pen and i'll be right back hold on all right i'm back so this is the little pen this pen don't come with it y'all i just had this already but i just used the bottom part but let me show y'all matter of fact y'all i'm gonna put it in the box and act like i'm doing the unboxing <laughs> real fake at least i'm telling y'all that's what i'm doing at least i'm telling y'all shit i ain't faking the funk and i got a case for it from amazon which i will link in my bio if y'all want the case but let me show y'all let me show y'all because it's just so cute and it's just so big and it's just like i haven't had an ipad and i don't know how long y'all welcome to my fake unboxing as if i just got this ipad but really i've had it for two weeks let's go so this is the ninth generation um ipad that i have Okay, come in a real cute box and you know what I'm saying? Apple baby, all apple around here. And this is in the space gray color, so yeah. Now, dun da da da, here is the part that you guys want to see, right? Oh! <laughs> yeah, I'm so dramatic. Anyway, I have not set up a. Um, Hold on, y'all. Let me clear my notifications because that's not supposed to be there. Hold on, y'all. Hold on. Hold on because that wasn't a part of the unboxing. <laughs> anyway, this is how it looks. Okay. This is the iPad. Um, Very cute. Very big. This shit is huge. Let me take it out of the box for y'all. And then I'm also show y'all my... Um, it come with a charger too, but they must have forgot that part. But yeah, <laughs> they didn't really. I'm just joking. Uh, I have a charger too, but... This is how it looks. Let me zoom in so y'all can see a little bit more. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Real classy, you know. Good taste, high quality, baby. And this is the case that I have for it. So this is the little pen I was just telling y'all I got. Right? I had this already at home. But they do have a pen that's for these iPads. But baby, they cost too much. So, um, yeah, this works really good. This is the case that I got off of Amazon for it. It just folds and open like this. And then, bam. And I also have a screen protector on mine because, baby, I was not about to be dropping this. So, it go in there like this. And then it's so cute that this actually has a pin area for if you do buy the pin, but that fits in there like that. Boom, baby, who do I think I am, honey? <laughs> Your girl is out here styling and profiling. So, yeah. Okay, unboxing is over. Hopefully y'all enjoy the comedy behind my unboxing. But anyway, it's time to eat. Um, Lately, y'all, first of all, I need groceries, that's number one. But lately, I have been making this little breakfast thing, which is like eggs, 
mushrooms, kale, and then tomatoes on top. And I actually been liking it. So I think that's what I'm about to make. So yeah, we about to make that real quick. And then I got to log back in. But I'm going to catch up with y'all later too, even after breakfast. Because that ain't the end of this vlog, baby. Uh-huh. Your girl got to... What else I got to do today? Hold on. Real quick. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. What else do I have to do? I know I got to wash clothes today for sure. I might run to Target to re-up on some stuff. And I need to plan out with videos I'm gonna drop this week, which I already have two filmed. Well, the one from yesterday and then today. So that's two. I wanna drop three, but maybe two vlogs and then like a regular kind of video. I really wanna do a chit chat video because y'all, I was ranting in my last video in the car. <laughs> but I just be having a lot to say. Like there's a lot of stuff that I don't be saying, which I don't try not to say. It's just, I don't know, like I don't say it unless I'm really passionate about it. Like I don't just talk just to talk. Anyway, I have to clean, I have to wash. This would be after work. Um, and then I gotta plan out my content and possibly go to Target. So this ain't the end of the vlog, but let's make some breakfast real quick because baby only got like five minutes left for my 15 minute break, which is so ghetto. But we ain't complaining. Let's get to it. Y'all, my mushrooms was looking a little sus, so I had to throw them out because I was not about to eat them. But this is my breakfast. I don't have no meat in here because I just don't. I don't have no, no, uh, you gotta make it work when you, when you low on groceries, y'all. But this is kale, um, obviously eggs, tomatoes, limited cheese, and then some taco dressing dressing so i'm gonna eat y'all go back to work but now i chat with y'all after work when i get off so we can do everything that we need to do oh well, let's taste it first before y'all go hold on and some people might think like it look a little weird i just go with what i think gonna taste good mm-hmm yep Hey y'all, two hours later, 10 hours later. First of all, y'all, let me give y'all an update because I had to make sure my mic was plugged in. Your girl took a nap. When I got out of work, y'all, I took a nap. I was like, let me lay down for a little bit, you know what I'm saying? And then I'm gonna give myself some time and I'm gonna get up and I'm gonna finish everything that I gotta do. Which technically, let me see. What did I have on the agenda to do today? So I had to do my, my planning for this week, which I'ma still do. And then I had to clean and I had to wash clothes and I was supposed to cook. So I didn't do none of that. <laughs> Your girl ain't do none of that, I'm just being honest. So this is gonna be a second two vlog, two day vlog because I'm still gonna do what I said I was gonna do, just not today. Anyway, y'all, I was like, let me turn on the camera real quick because I just got up not too long ago, y'all, and my face is just breaking out so bad, y'all. Like, that's I got more of these things on my face. So forgive me if I look crazy right now, but this hair is breaking my face out. And this would, that would be the only reason why I would take them out faster than I, I need to is because I can't deal with the keep getting breakouts. Like, if y'all know something, I heard people say that you should wash your braids or something or the braid hair with like apple cider vinegar or something but i don't know but it happened every time i get braids in my head but that ain't why i turned the camera on girl i was just like oh my gosh i'm just so happy i moved to houston y'all like y'all don't understand i'm just so happy i'm so happy 
And I'm saying that because it's just so much to do and it's not just partying. Like some people think Houston is just all about clubs and partying. Like granted, baby, you can get down with the get down. There's so many places you can go. But you know, I like to do I like to do different shit. So I literally, y'all, just go on Eventbrite, which I'm gonna show y'all in a second. And I just find stuff. Like I type in what I like. I like food, I like yoga, I like fitness, I like Pilates. I like cons. I like anything, bitch. I like everything. So I'm like, hmm, let me go on here. And I always do this, y'all. I just be randomly booking shit. But it's just so crazy how. And you can go in here and you can do free stuff. Like, you know, some people are like, oh, you got to have money. You don't always have to have money to do stuff, y'all. Like, I just booked four events <laughs> this week, bitch. <laughs> and they all free. So let me show y'all real quick. Let me get y'all a little. <laughs> This is just a, uh, and then you can do this for any city, y'all, that y'all live in. But especially if you live in a big city and you don't know what to do, just go on Eventbrite, type in what you like, put your city in, and put when, what date, or if it's that week or the weekend, and then type the free. You got to push the free if that's what you're looking for. If you want to pay for tickets and shit, you can do that too. Y'all, look at what time it is. 11 o'clock at night, y'all. And I'm just getting up not too long ago. But I wanted to show y'all real quick some of the stuff that I type. And look, fun, things to do, Houston, wine tasting, yoga. I mean, girl, whatever you want to do. Okay, so let me just show y'all the yoga options that was just popping up. So I got for this week, obviously, in Houston and look at this y'all look at this one right here bitch i can't go to this one well i can but i need to find out like how you do it because when you go down here and they give you all the details y'all so you get click read more and i'm pretty sure people probably already know this but this is just like a gem if you are somebody that just don't know what to do you just move to a big city or whatever or you live in your own city and you keep doing the same stuff just go in here but this one y'all when you like push tickets it's like make a donation or something, which I don't mind doing. But when you do that, like, how you how do I know I'm going to get a ticket? Like, you know what I'm saying? So they got on here, the, the lady information. I'm going to call them tomorrow, text them tomorrow. So that's cute as hell. Complimentary yoga and mimosa. Y'all, they had one on here where at the Westin. Hold on, y'all, because they got like a rooftop. I think you got to pay for that one, y'all. But it's like a rooftop at the Westin. I was like, damn. There you go, right there, y'all. Look at that. Ooh, girl, you got to pay for this one, though. Baby, you ain't about to get in the West and on the rooftop for free. But, yeah, look at this, girl. You get to read more on there. And then let me show y'all some other ones aside from yoga. So, like, I just typed up one for, ooh, I did a wine tasting. Let me show y'all this one. Y'all, I'm so excited. Like, they got so much stuff. Look, free game night. Look at this shit. Wine. Oh, I signed up for this one, too. I don't know if I'm going to make it to this one this week. But wine, women, and wealth. I mean, like, baby, don't think Houston is all about partying, honey. Okay. Yeah. Don't sleep on us. <laughs> you hear me talking about us. Bitch, just move here. And then, hold on. It was one other thing I wanted to show y'all. Was it this one? Oh, the festival, y'all. Look, it's. I didn't even know it's a festival this weekend. Girl, look at this. Baby, a uh, eighth annual uh Houston Creole Festival. Yo, I know that food gonna be there. Bust in there, y'all. Look at that. Look at that girl. The Nola experience, honey. This is not free though. Okay. Not saying that, you know, I mind, but look at them tickets. Look at that girl. Look at that. Look at that. Girl, you can do whatever you wanna do, honey. Please don't sit your ass in that house. If you can go outside, y'all, try to do at least one new thing. Look, people selling this shit out already. Look at that. Somebody done paid for 800 Man, they is... This probably gonna be lit. Hey, this gonna be lit. I don't know. I might gotta pull up. <laughs> but no, let me... That was all I wanted to show y'all because there's a whole lot up, more up here. But that was really what I wanted to show y'all. So yeah but basically yeah y'all if you could go outside and do new things do it please do because life is too short i'm sorry and i don't want to sound cliche and start preaching on this camera lord jesus because i will so i only been here for two months and i done been so many places like watch my spilling tea on houston video that i posted probably like a few weeks ago where i listed out literally 20 places that i went to and at that time i was only here for a month 
Yeah, I wanted to also too ask y'all, have y'all seen the Jeffrey Dahmer series? I mean, I knew about Jeffrey Dahmer, but I heard about him, but I didn't know like the full story. I just knew he ate people, but I didn't know like the extent of him eating people and in the, in the people that he was targeting. Your girl binge watched that series on Netflix in a day or two, 10 episodes. Man, if you ain't seen it, check it out. But if you check it out, please just already have in mind that it is disturbing. Like, it's disturbing, especially if you're black, especially if you're a male, just in general. Just if, you, if you're black, period. Because I feel like it was obvious that's who he was targeting. Like, obviously. But check it out if you have not checked it out already. Again, I finished it in like two days. One thing about me, y'all, and this last thing I'm going to say is that I see y'all in the morning tomorrow. But one thing about me, baby, if I like somebody or I like something, I'm going hard at it. <laughs> Hold up. What it say on this top? I'm going hard. Oh my gosh, I can't remember that saying. Anyway, I will binge watch something that I'm really into in two or three days. If I'm feeling somebody that I really like, I'm on your ass. Like, y'all, one thing about us Aries, baby, we either like something or we don't. It ain't no in between. We either like somebody or we don't. And I don't, and I ain't mean to relate this to liking people, but it just goes across the board. If you're an Aries, you know. If you know somebody that's an Aries, you know. It's either one way or the other with us. So, yeah, check out the series if you haven't already. But I'm going to the gym in the morning, so peace. Good morning, y'all. I told y'all I was going to see y'all in the morning. It's the next day. Um, I promised to close this vlog out today <laughs> because I was supposed to close it out yesterday. But today is Tuesday, the next day. So I'm um, basically, y'all, it's these gnats around here that came from them bananas that was in my house that was over there, which I had to throw away. But they are so fucking irritating because they will fly all in your face. Like, so disrespectful. Like, they pay rent. Like, <laughs> flies and gnats and stuff. They will fly all up in your face, y'all, like, and don't care. Hope y'all are doing well. I feel good this morning. Just got out the shower not too long ago. Threw my Savage X Fenzy onesie on. Y'all, I didn't cut holes in this onesie and made, <laughs> and made the little finger holes. Like, what? Y'all, it is just raggedy. Tell Rihanna to send me a new one, because this one is, done but it's gonna work for the day so i gotta wash clothes what else oh i signed up for that yoga class i told y'all about which you're gonna go there later i gotta wash and i gotta clean my bathroom which is not gonna be too much and i got and i gotta run a target maybe i can do target right after i come back from that yoga class then i'm gonna have to come home and make dinner too god damn who told me to be an adult <laughs> anyway let's put a load in i'm on my break right now so yeah, your girl is still working and filming in between. So let's put a load in real quick. I just put some dishes in the dishwasher not too long ago. So that's what's going right now. And let's start to wash. Y'all, I got so many clothes I got to wash. It's kind of embarrassing because I don't really wash every week. Like how often do y'all wash your clothes? Like be honest, don't lie. Don't try to make, don't, 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 don't lie. Be honest. <laughs> How often do y'all really wash clothes? I wash clothes on a hundred, probably like once every three, four weeks, honestly, because I don't, I don't do a lot. And then most of the time, y'all, it's just gym clothes. So technically, you know, my basket be kind of like, I wait till my basket damn near is about to tip over to wash clothes. Y'all, I swear my electric bill here compared to when I was living in Virginia, which I understand because it's hot in here, so I have to have the air on more. Man, that thing is like double what I was paying in Virginia. I said, Lord, God damn, God damn. I think I showed y'all before my little jar. I got to re-up on with my um, pods to wash with, so. Y'all, there's so many clothes to wash, but we gonna start off washing dark clothes. That's what I use. That's what I be having the most of is dark clothes. I don't be really wearing having too many colored clothes to wash but the good thing is i like this washing machine because you can fill up the washing machine because it's big so i remember at my old spot <laughs> i used to put clothes in the washing machine i had to share a washing machine and dryer with the people in my building man when i tell you i used to stuff that damn washer that shit used to be shaking and i used to hear it in my apartment and i still ain't go downstairs and fix it 
Storming for a couple hours When we finish take a shower I can do this for hours And hours and hours I need to take them damn boxes to the um dumpster they, they've been sitting there i'm not even gonna hold y'all them boxes been sitting there for probably like three weeks like that's od as many times as i left out already and came back and i still have not taken the boxes down there it is crazy but anyway um i'm gonna go ahead and let that wash and uh of course switch them out when they're ready and then i probably actually clean the bathroom on my lunch break or when i get off the only reason why i said on my lunch no i'm gonna just wait till i get off because my lunch break y'all i never actually eat lunch on my lunch break like i be eating between work but on my lunch break i'm always doing something outside of relaxing like i'm supposed to be chilling on my lunch break and i'm always doing something on my lunch break anyway point of the matter is i'm gonna wait until i get off i get off at 4 30 and that class is not the yoga class is not until six so y'all i just hope it's not too hot because baby if it's too hot i'm sorry y'all i ain't going <laughs> i ain't going i ain't paid for it or nothing so i don't care but we'll see i keep y'all posted i'm drinking my coffee i'm trying to see if um b simone and them are gonna drop their podcast visual on instagram i mean on youtube today because usually they drop the audio the day before and then the next day they usually drop the visuals and i'm excited because i am zoe or i'm zo however you say his name y'all know who i'm talking about he is on this episode so i know this is gonna be a good episode girl and i'm excited i'm ready to tune in okay i'm ready to tune in so mm. peace I'll always love you. hey y'all <laughs> I'm about to switch the clothes out, y'all. They been ready, but I was working. So let's put the clothes in the dryer. Okay, okay, okay. Do y'all use dryer sheets? Um, I heard somebody told me that fabric softener, not dryer sheets. I saw a thing on TikTok where they say fabric softener is not good to use in your washing machine. They said they fuck up your washing machine. Let me know if that's a lie or if there's any truth to that because I really did hear that. But I don't use fabric softener, but I'm just asking. I don't know. But I definitely do use drying sheets. And baby, if you ain't using Snuggle, then what is you doing? Because this is the best drying sheets you can use. I don't use no other drying sheets. Ooh, and when I make my bed, I don't know if y'all do this, but my mom used to tell me this. When she used to make the bed, before she put the sheets on there, she used to put what well, she still do. Um, put dryer sheets like real flat up there by your head part and then I think like in the middle part of the bed and then put the sheet on there the fitted sheet girl and she put them inside the pillowcases oh my gosh and this is right after you wash your linen girl if y'all don't do that do that like I don't know because it might be be careful though because some people's skin might be sensitive to put them in a pillowcase but definitely put them like in certain different parts of the bed and then put the sheet on there it smells so good <laughs> i put like three or four in there y'all i be putting a lot in there <laughs> i will put my next load in on my lunch break y'all but i just wanted to update y'all on the on the clothes we trying to we trying to get things done, completed while doing work, and I'm editing. So yeah, y'all, your girl is busy trying to get this content out for y'all because I love y'all and I know I've been slacking. I'm trying to do better, you know what I'm saying? So anyway, I'll catch up with y'all later. Peace. I'm on my lunch break now, y'all, so I just wanted to update y'all that the podcast dropped. So anyway, that was all I wanted to come over here for. Bye. You could be like, you know, um, Ooh, no, no, I lost my virginity when I was, um, I think I was 16. What's up, y'all? So, 
I got like 10 minutes before I'm off of work. Already dressed, y'all. And I didn't even notice earlier today that my nail broke. But it's kind of cool because I'm supposed to be getting my nails and my feet done this week anyway. So, I'm going to do a maintenance vlog for y'all. The only thing is, usually maintenance vlogs, you get like nails, feet, lashes, hair. You get all that done. But, only thing I got to get done is my nails and my feet. Which is going to be at the same place. But, I do want to do um like i guess like a at home let me say no spa and all that just my skincare at night or something which i probably include which is still considered maintenance because i did get a comment where somebody asked about my skincare which i don't have a lot i just got about four products anyway i'm already dressed for this yoga class y'all please pray for me because i already know it's about to be hot okay well let me tell y'all the dilemma how did i book a yoga class and i don't have a yoga mat so this is what's gonna have to happen i'm gonna have to literally leave out as soon as i get off which i'm already prepared for because i got on my clothes already i'm gonna have to go to target is one not too far from me i saw already that they got a yoga mat in stock for like 10 or 12 dollars or something i'm gonna pick that up and then i'm gonna go to the yoga spot however i have to go back to target later on once i leave the yoga place to get all the rest of the stuff that i need the only reason why i'm not grabbing it while i'm there to get the yoga mat is because i'm on a time slide you know i already got my laura vase ready to go if y'all don't have these glasses these glasses are per first of all they perfect for everyday wear but they definitely perfect for like running errands and stuff and like you know, if you don't want nobody all up in your face and you just want to still look cute. <laughs> Dear girl, you knew what you was doing when you made these, baby. I like the other ones too. Um, the new eras, but them, you got to like really like put some shit on with them. These, you can kind of be chilling, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> doing your little one-two, running to the store, doing your little errands, but you still looking fly. Y'all, I'm impatiently waiting to clock out. I literally have 10 minutes. Sometimes work me in a way, you know what I'm saying? Like I got things to do, places to go, people to see, a vlog to film. <laughs> I'm kind of excited too, y'all, because this place that I'm going to, let me see, I forgot, it's called, it's not Prospect Park. That's where I went over the weekend, I'm tripping. It's called something with a P Park, Patterson Park. And I looked it up when I first heard it. I was like, why does it sound like, it don't sound too appealing. And then I looked it up on TikTok, y'all. I look everything up on TikTok to get the visuals of where I'm about to go. Y'all can't take me seriously when them glasses on. But when it's multiple, um, you know. Ooh, it's so cute here. Summer camp for adults in Houston. Hold on now, they sell drinks? Hold on, bitch. We might be getting a drink after yoga today. They sell drinks, girl. They look like they got a whole bar over there. Okay. <laughs> I'm off of work finally. Okay. And I was looking on the Target app, y'all. I just don't understand why y'all still sitting at the light and it's green. Do green not mean go? Like, I'm confused. Oh my gosh. I I, I don't know if y'all can tell from just watching me. Y'all can tell I ain't got no patience. But anyway, I get distracted easily. But on the Target app, it tells you what aisle the item is that you're looking for is in. And I didn't know that. So all this time, I be roaming around in Target or whatever. I don't know if they do it at Walmart, but roaming around looking for shit. And the whole time, it tells you exactly where it's at. So that's a plus for me right now because I need to literally be in and out. In and out because I'm already running behind you gonna choose us every time cause it's cheaper to keep up <laughs> fuck them all every day the sun won't shine but that's why i love them all y'all can use the scissors hey y'all so we are here and i got this headband y'all from out of target i ended up getting a purple um yoga mat and then i found this purple sweatband thing you know girl trying to be cute anyway we here i'm about to get out in a minute i'm actually here 15 minutes early but i don't know why i'm nervous like oh I, I don't know but i'm gonna show y'all how i look real quick and then i'm gonna get back in the car matter of fact i'm gonna just wait till i get out i'm gonna just wait till i get out but it just look like a bunch of caucasian people outside drinking alcohol it don't look like nothing about yoga <laughs> 
It just is a whole bunch of men out here with beers and shit. Like, where's the yoga? <laughs> I'm so serious. I'm about to show y'all real quick. Can y'all see? Y'all see it's just people like out here. Like, I was dramatic when I said a whole lot of people. But it's a food truck right there. But yeah, um, maybe it's up on that deck somewhere. Look, it just look like people come here to maybe drink or something. Like, where is the yoga, baby? Because I will take my ass home. So let's get out i think i see it now i see the yoga sign so let's go all i'm gonna take because it's not as hot as i thought it would be i'm just gonna take my yoga mat and my water i don't think i'm gonna be sweating for real honestly yeah i don't think so i'll see you in a second All right, y'all, so I guess from here, y'all can just watch. Class has not started yet, but I'm excited. Big inhale, big breath out. Knees bent to 90 degrees. Hover for just a breath more. Straighten the other and then switch. Straight forward to a high plank position. Hands are under your shoulders, butt down, abs in. Hips do not droop. Exhale, awesome. Y'all, that was so damn cute. Like, that was cute as hell. I was struggling. I ain't gonna hold y'all. I was struggling between the gym and Pilates and doing that. Jesus Christ. I did burn 275 calories. Wow. In 45 minutes? I'm tired, y'all. I'm just being honest. So, we still gonna go to Target, though. Gotta go to Target. Let's see if it's one near here. Target nearby, 1.3 miles, six minutes away. Off to Target we go. They was offering 20% off if you get an alcoholic beverage. I say they trying to tempt people because there's a bar literally right there. The actual place is a bar. So I was like, let me just walk away. Because if I take a drink, I'm going to take my ass home and I ain't going to go to Target. So, <laughs> got to have discipline sometimes. But we are going to get some wine out of Target though, baby. I ain't say I got that much discipline and I don't want nothing today. I want some wine today. That's one of the things I got to get out of my off my list for Target. So, All right, y'all. So, we are in Target. And I have a list everything I need to get I don't know if it's all needed matter of fact no I'm not gonna get everything on this list I'm gonna get the main things on this list which is paper towels toothpaste laundry detergent wine cups obey seasoning because I have salmon I don't know if I'm cooking tonight y'all I'm just being honest I might end up stopping and getting something but I still need obey because I'm gonna have to make the salmon either tonight or tomorrow. So I'm, a, I'm not gonna talk this whole time in here. I'm gonna just grab everything and then I see y'all at the crib. Yeah. Yeah. Y'all, $50 for what? $50 for what? I'm laughing at the man in there. He told my song, hey, you cute, you got an Instagram? I said no and walked off. He said, what? I said no. Like, the fuck? Did you not hear me the first time, my nigga? People be weird. Like, you just gotta watch out for people, man. I was watching my um surroundings all the way until I left the store because he was mad sus. Like, I was in the aisle by myself and he just walked towards me and was like hey you got an instagram you don't know where i'm from <laughs> shorty i'm from baltimore don't play with me you better back the fuck up the fuck i got my little pepper spray with me too <laughs> that's all i got y'all <laughs> anyway enough jokes man seriously you really gotta pay attention to your surroundings y'all because people are weird but let me put my four eyes on because i cannot see and I will see y'all. I keep saying I'm gonna see y'all at the crib and then end up getting back on camera again. Chick-fil-A, here I come. The fact that the police officer is 
coordinating the Chick-fil-A line is just blowing me right now. Chick-fil-A, y'all food ain't even all that. Meanwhile, I love it. I think it's just like people be saying, it really just be the customer service for me. Like Chick-fil-A food is really mid. That light is not helping. Chick-fil-A food is not great, but it's tasty enough and the, and the customer service is just A1. It's impeccable. It's shitting on you other fast food places. <laughs> Hi. Can I get free time? Can I get a grilled chicken nugget kids meal? And can you substitute my fry for a Mac and my toy for ice cream cone? Uh, we only have cups at the moment, is that fine? If that's all you have, yeah. yeah. And the drink? Uh, a Sun Joy. <laughs> and can I do um, buffalo and Chick-fil-A sauce? So each or how many of each? Uh, you can do one each, that's fine. Right. Anything else wrong? No, that's fine. And I have Apple Pay. Yes. Okay. Is that how you pronounce it? Yep. Wait, how did you say it? Rashaya? Yep. You said it right. Some people say Rashaya. I just had to look at it real quick. <laughs> Alright, yeah, All right, thank you. Ooh, I'm kind of mad they ain't got that cone, baby. I wanted that cone. I don't want the cup. But you know, at the end of the day, you got to go with the flow. If they say they ain't got it, then you got to take what they got, right? I guess. Y'all, I get the same thing every time I come to Chick-fil-A. A chicken nugget kids meal. Sometimes I get grilled chicken. Sometimes I get the regular chicken nuggets. Substitute the fry for a Mac. Substitute the ice cream, I mean the toy for ice cream cone. And then what I'm gonna do is, cause this food, I ain't gonna hold y'all, this food gonna be gone by the time I get home. <laughs> ah, this food is gonna be gone. I believe in eating the drive. But what you do is you mix the mac and cheese with the chicken nuggets and then you pour the buffalo sauce on top. But before you mix the chicken nuggets with the mac and cheese, you gotta eat like one or two chicken nuggets in the Chick-fil-A sauce. That's why I got the Chick-fil-A sauce. Y'all, I'm greedy. I am real greedy, but guess what, boo? Long as I stay in that gym, your girl is gonna be fine, okay? Everybody is responsible for their own time. Technically, they don't have to fix anything because it's up to you. I mean, it's it's your responsibility to track your own time. But if they messed it up, of course they gotta pay you for it. Hey, I hit him up today, like, bro, like, what's going on? My check was not what it was supposed to be. It ain't hit yet, but it's pending, and I can see it. Well, at least they gonna give you a check. It's just going to take a little minute to come in. Yeah, I was asking that because I need, it, uh, I need that money tomorrow. That's what I'm saying. Like, if I put it in my account, will I be able to use it? No, just you had to just go cash it somewhere if you need the money tomorrow. That way you can just get the cash. You just going to have to pay probably like $2. I, was I don't know. Some places charge like, it just depends on how much the check is. All right, what you got going on? You good? Yeah, I just got in the house. I'm kind of tired now. I'm getting a shower in a minute. Yeah. But just hit me up tomorrow then. All right, love you too. All right, y'all, we back in the crib. I mean, I was talking to my brother. So look, y'all, I'm gonna show y'all what I got from Target or whatever. So first, oh yeah, my food is gone, by the way. I told y'all that food was not gonna last. I ain't eat the ice cream because I forgot I'm gonna drink wine. So I had to choose if I wanted wine or ice cream because both of them together was not gonna go. And baby, I chose the wine. <laughs> so anyway, paper towels. I used to actually get the ones that got like print on there, but I don't like them no more because they look a little childish to me. Then I got these Pringles that I was eating while I was in the store. <laughs> Obey, this was literally the last Obey, y'all. So it was meant for me to get this. And then I got two bananas because I'm gonna go like market, market shopping. Probably like in a few days from H-E-B. Y'all know that's where I be grocery shopping at. But I did need some bananas for my oatmeal in the morning. So got that. And avocado for my lunch. Cups. Okay. And baby, this is what I'm looking for. That's what I'm looking for. That wine, baby. Okay. Usually I get, um, what is it? Barefoot or Sutter Home. But they ain't have one, they ain't have that, so got some Tide Pods or Game Pods. 
toothpaste. And I think the last thing is some eggs. So, eggs for breakfast. Had to take a sip before I wash and clean the bathroom. Mm. Oh, baby. I had cupcake before, so I knew how it tastes already, but. Mm. I'm so fucking awesome. I'm so awesome. <laughs> Whew, your girl is out the shower. When I tell y'all I'm a snore tonight, baby, I'm a snore tonight. <laughs> so I can take this thing off now. Ouch. Shit still hurt. So it's almost like a white head right now, which is perfect. That's the that's the time you actually supposed to put it on there when it's like a white head. But let me show y'all what they call it. These is what it is. Mighty patch. Okay. I'm gonna put one on there. Well, I'm gonna do it after I wipe, wash my face. So at nighttime, I don't do like a whole routine. I just wash wipe my face with witch hazel witch hazel cleaning cloths. I use like two of these, but. My face is probably dirty because I've been outside all day, but this is pretty much, I use these in the morning too. I actually been using these a lot lately because you know, they're really good for your skin. Oh, I just wiped my eye. Oh shit, I'm trying to take my damn lash off. Girl, I be forgetting sometimes I got these damn lashes on. <laughs> Oh my gosh, Lord Jesus. Now my lash probably gonna be hanging off. I'll fix it tomorrow, I ain't doing it tonight. But y'all see that one motherfucker right there? Look how big it's getting. That's because it's right at the head, but I'm not gonna pop it because these other ones I told y'all earlier are flat now. I really wish I would've did the apple cider vinegar thing with these braids or my hair beforehand, but I'm gonna put one on my face now. I was gonna put some fat water on my face, but I'm not doing that because yeah, I'm not doing that. So I'm putting it right. Oh my gosh, that bad boy is big. So I'm putting it right on there. I'm telling y'all, by the morning, with it being that big like that, that's perfect. By the morning, that thing will be gone. <laughs> that thing gonna be gone. It's just that these dark spots. I ain't about to get into it. I'm, I'm, I ain't doing it. Nope, not right now. So y'all already know I use my Nivea every time I get out of the shower. This is the Deep Nourishing Serum in Almond Oil. Very to very dry, dry to very dry skin, which is what I have. And then I also use this Nivea Skin Firming and Toning. These two together. And then I'm showing y'all everything because I'm going to end this vlog and lay down. Um, PFB Vanish for my bikini area. Dove Deodorant. And then I put some Aquaphor on my lips and on my feet because everybody knows that skin on your feet is different than the rest of your skin. And that's just that. So, yeah, I'm going to check in one last time in the bed drinking my wine. And then that's going to be it, y'all. So I'll see y'all in a minute. Peace. Okay, y'all. Your girl's in bed. Cheers again. Woo, it's been a long day. Long two days, actually. So, Anyway, that's it for this vlog, y'all. If y'all like the vlog, give me a thumbs up. I'm out of breath. <laughs> 
If you like the video, give me a thumbs up. If you do not like the video, give me a thumbs up. I appreciate y'all for clicking on that video. And I will see you guys in my next vlog. Mm. Peace.